Hello everyone! Welcome back to my time at Portia, where in our last episode we cleared level 4 of the Hazardous Ruins and beat the boss there. And it looks like our drying rack is out of apricots. Let's get a few more dried apple slices going since I've been using those to restore my stamina when quarrying. I'm going to hop on Whisper and run up to the Commerce Guild for a commission. And then we will take care of our chickens and our furnaces and decide what's going on today. I have been really neglecting Pinky. Hi, Pinky. Aww, you have no fish for me lately. You have no time for me lately. I need to go fishing and get some catfish or whatever else I can get so that I have presents for Pinky. Hi Antoine, I will say hello to you after I get my commission. Let's check the A. Six water buckets for Dr. Zoo. One water engine. Four fur scarves, we're gonna go for the water engine. Although I was a little bit tempted by the Dr. Zoo commission just because I think we're fairly close to two hearts with him and getting a commission that gives him friendship points would have been helpful. We're like right on the edge with Nora though. So maybe we will see if we can't give Nora a lemon juice today and invite her on a play date tomorrow. We could also buy some planter boxes from the church while we're at it. Lee is heading down. I think Nora will be up at the church. If she's not, I'm wasting an hour of my day riding Whisper up here. Well, it's not really a waste because even if she's not here, I can get the planter boxes and the planter boxes will give me some cash. So let's go inside if we can. So first question, is Nora in the church? And the answer is no, she is not. So we'll just grab our planter boxes. Eight planter boxes for 16 data disks, which will get turned into cash. Preferably when the market is up a little bit compared to where it was last time I stopped in at the store. And we'll do some somersaults before we get back on Whisper. I really like the autumn colors, so lovely. Such a pretty view from up here, even if I didn't get what I was hoping for in terms of a little bit of extra friendship with Nora. Here she is. She just wasn't up at the church yet. Hi, Nora. People want the guidance of the church when it comes to technologies from the corrupted world. After all, these technologies were what led to the destruction of the human race. Would you appreciate some lemon juice today? I like it. You're very nice. And Nora became our buddy, which means that we can invite Nora on a play date. Um, let's meet her at Peach Plaza for dinner tomorrow. That will give us time to do other things earlier in the day. And let's say hello to Emily. I should start carrying eggs for her. Sonia made me plant some cucumbers and tomatoes as the basis for some facial cream. I'm actually looking forward to the result. That's nice. I hope you're going to share your facial cream with your friend Antoine, but given that you and Sonia and Antoine seem to hang out together a lot, I imagine that you're all going to try it. All right, we have a water engine to make. And now that we have more copper wire, we can make more hardwood flooring and continue to fill out our hardwood area here and put down, I, I'd like to put one more generator here and two more furnaces. So let me just take a minute to gather the materials from the machines and um, how are our generators doing one day? One day, this one only has 10 hours, and I am going to make sure that I only use regular wood for fueling the generators, because 
it is a lot more efficient. Each piece of regular wood compared to fueling them with hardwood or ironwood, um, given that you can turn your hardwood into regular wood, um, you, you get more efficiency from fueling the generators with regular wood. So I was paying attention to my comments and I am going to make sure that I use the regular wood only, but I am going to go ahead and refuel the one that is lowest right now, which is this one right here. All of the others have over a day, so I can wait to refuel them. All right, I will bring you back after I have gathered all of the bars and refilled everything that needs refilling and put the inventory items away. All right, all of my furnaces are working. I've got my two cutters making ironwood planks and hardwood planks because I don't have enough carbon steel to have them making steel plates right now. And I have set the empty furnace to make stone brick just to get a reserve of that because I got a hint in the comments that I was going to need some soon. My crystal tree is ready to harvest. I got 10 crystals and a sapphire from that. So that's nice to have. I'm going to go ahead and put the sapphire and the crystals away. We have massive numbers of crystals at this point and it might not be a bad idea for us to start making crystal necklaces to give away. I just need to remember who it is that particularly likes them. Now we have a water engine commission. So I have grabbed everything I need for that. Let's go ahead and get it built. And I am going to need to make some more bearings before we take another water engine commission again. Small engines and plates, perfect. Now that we've finished with that one, I want to make another generator. Oh, uh, should I do another industrial furnace first? I'll do the generator first because at the moment all of my machines are being powered. Another generator will give me the ability to power two more machines, whether it's cutters or grinders or more furnaces. So I have the civil furnace, uh, not in my inventory, but I, I have it in a chest. I need two industrial engines, five copper coils, and four, uh, oh, sorry, 10 steel plates. I have all the steel plates I need, so let's go grab the industrial engines. I will put away the old parts while I'm at it. Wait a minute, this is the wrong chest. I need my mechanical parts chest. All right, industrial engines, and I'll put away the old parts. I have one copper coil, so I need to get some iron bars out to make more. And then I think I put the other furnace in this chest. I did. Come down here. All right, four more copper coils and we'll be able to make another generator. I see more ruin diving for copper wire in my future. I could, I suppose, set up a grinder to make copper wire, but it is such a common drop down in the ruins that it seems like it's more efficient to do it that way. And that is it for our steel plates until we get more carbon steel made and onto the grinders. Not the grinders, the cutters. All right, can we get you in place, please? This is going to be fun. All right, let's stand right on top of this furnace. I would cut this out, except that I think that those of you who are watching this Let's Play to decide whether or not you want to get the game yourself deserve to know how difficult it sometimes is to place items where you want them.
All right, finally. That was crazy. That that really should not have been as painful as it was. Okay, at this point, if I don't run and hand in my Commerce Commission, I'm not going to have the opportunity to do so, and I would really prefer to have that done today. So let's go quickly and hand in the Commerce Commission. Am I already too late? Antoine has gone inside his apartment. Hi, Django. Not sword is in his justice and loyalty. The rest is just for show. Knots can always eat for free in my restaurant. Cheers. And what qualifies one to be a knight who gets to eat free? That's what I want to know. Hi, Polly. Men should be as strong as me. Mars? Oh, come on, he's not even close. Well, I'm a little bit frustrated with how long it took to place that generator. But I am going to go ahead and make another industrial furnace. If I can, I might need to wait for more plates. Yeah, I'm going to need five steel plates and five marble planks. I have the planks. I'll go ahead and make the industrial core which is resin, bloodstones, and stone. You need to go outside. Horses do not belong near cutters and furnaces. Very bad plan. Industrial core. I'll go ahead and make four because I do want two more furnaces eventually, even though I don't have the material for them yet. Nothing else needs to go in here. The metal bars and the plates can go back there and the stone and the engines. Well, these are going to be working overnight. How are we doing for carbon steel? This has four hours left, and I'm going to start it on charcoal for more carbon steel when it's finished. I think I'm going to go cut some trees, and I will bring you back uh, around midnight when I'm ready to switch over the furnace and put the carbon steel on. Or possibly not until a little later than that, depending on what else I'll get up to. All right, well, I've just spent the last several in-game hours chopping down trees with a focus on the largest trees, because those give me not only wood, hardwood, and ironwood, but also resin, which I've been using a lot of, rubber fruits, um, and birds, tree sap which is also useful for crafting. I also got three bird's nests, which I'm going to go ahead and open. I got a data disc in one of them, and three eggs and two feathers. Also a few wild cocoons. But I do believe that my furnace that was working on carbon steel bars... Oh, it's not quite done yet. It is 15 minutes left, so I will... Go and put away these cocoons and the tree sap in here. And the fiber. And then I should be able to start that furnace again, working on charcoal for more carbon steel. Yes, I can make 50 charcoal, which is what I want. And I will grab the copper bars and I'm actually going to stop the stone brick furnace. Um, no, I'm not. I'm going to leave the stone brick furnace overnight and I might stop it in the morning and switch it over. Or I might just put down a couple more furnaces. Hardwood planks and ironwood planks. 
Okay, you are going to be canceled. And we're going to make some more steel plates. Yes, I'm sure I want to cancel. Three more steel plates. It's not going to be enough for another furnace, but it's a beginning. And we'll switch hardwood planks over here. Oh, wait. We are not on max efficiency now. All right, we'll just do one hardwood plank. 73 efficiency I can live with, I think. All right, it's getting late. I should get some rest. I think I'm actually going to go to bed in my bed tonight for a change. We've got our date with Nora tomorrow. That's something to look forward to. One of these days, we'll, we'll do some more with our house, too. Maybe get rid of all the fans. Now, we're still not going to have enough steel plates for making another furnace yet. But we have some cotton that's ready. So let me just move this and grab more cotton seeds to plant. Might not be a bad idea to do some more wheat for the chickens too. All right, let's harvest and plant. And harvest and plant. And harvest and plant. And then I will put these seeds back in their chest. And go and grab my commission for the day. Also, my wood from the wood chest. You know, I thought when I finished the tree farm and started getting my wood delivered that I was never going to have to chop trees again. But of course, you need tree sap and resin for things. Mary Gail, where are you off to? Hey, I want to talk to you. My son Gust is nothing like me. Well, except for his talent and good-looking face. <laughs> and I want to give you a tea table. It's my last one. I like it. You're very nice. And Gail became our buddy. Does Gail allow for it? No, you can't play with Gail. I guess he's too busy as the mayor. But I'm just wondering where he's running off to in such a hurry. Because this is not behavior I've seen from Mayor Gail before. Like, he's in this huge rush. Where is he going? What's he up to? I guess it's Saturday, and on Saturdays he usually goes fishing. But he's just kind of um, playing on my stone wall now. Gail, is this your second childhood? He's going in circles. Gail, what are you up to? This is so strange. Well, I'm kind of disappointed that I'm not getting friendship points for him walking past my, my relic in my yard. I had heard that if you put relics out in your yard where people could see them, you would get friendship points for people viewing them, and I have not seen that happen yet in my game. Antoine, I have a commission. Zoo, my idol. Every time I think of him, my heart flutters. That was fast. Such an efficient builder. How close are we to being able to upgrade our house? And by that, I'm talking about cash. All A grades today. Remington wants warm clothes. We could do that easily. Minister Lee wants rainbow flowers. We could do that easily, too. And they are fairly similar in price. More cash for Remington. I'm not getting an Emperor Goliath for Django. I am also not getting bronze plates for Polly. So it's between the rainbow flowers and the warm clothes. And I think I'm going to do the warm clothes, not only because it's worth a little bit more, but because we're doing better socially with Remington than we are with Minister Lee. And while a commission for Minister Lee might bump us up to an associate, 
A commission with Remington plus a lemon juice might actually get us to buddy status. And I would really like that. I can't do much more with the workshop until I have more carbon steel for making more furnaces. See you later, Nora. Don't forget our date tonight. What in the world was Gail up to there? So bizarre. You stay there. Can we make any more plates yet? I've got lots more charcoal, but the carbon steel bars just take so long. Okay, I'm going to stop the stone bricks and the copper bars, and I'm going to have both of these furnaces making carbon steel now that I have a little more charcoal to do it with, I think. Assuming... Well... No, I'll just do the one that had the stone brick in it. Cancel the stone brick. Because 11 charcoal only makes 11 carbon steel, and I don't see a whole lot of point in dividing that between two furnaces. I'll wait until I have a bit more. How's this one doing? It's 25. Three days left. Can I make one more? I can make one more. 12 carbon steel bars. And 12 carbon steel bars is going to take over a day. Of course, we're not at maximum efficiency right now because we've got too many machines running. All right, I don't need to make hardwood planks right now. I've got a good backlog of those. We'll cancel the hardwood planks. Now everything should be on 100% efficiency again because we're only running eight machines instead of nine. And we have the ability to make a few more, no, one more steel plate. Well, I'm gonna clean out my inventory and, no, I'm gonna take care of my chickens first and then I'll clean out my inventory. Just check your food, make sure there's plenty in there. 22 out of 30. You're out of wheat. You, they seem to like the wheat best, but they've got lots of bamboo papaya and snake berries, and that should be okay. Seems like they were eating the wheat preferentially and then the plant fiber. I could give them some more plant fiber. I have some more of that. Be interesting to see whether they eat the plant fiber before they eat the snake berries and the bamboo papaya. All right, I'm gonna clear out the inventory and bring it back when that's done. All right, so I've cleared out my inventory. I can't make this furnace until I have more plates. I am going to go ahead and make those casual hoodies that I need for my commission and then deliver that. And I think I'm also gonna go up to the church and buy some more planter boxes. Mm, sure, let's change the color of this light to blue for the furnace area. So we are a little bit short of the fiber cloth we need for our casual hoodies. I need worn fur and plant fiber, I think, to make more fiber cloth. Let's double check that. Let's do four on this one and four on this one. I think I was only short one or two. So it shouldn't take very long to get what we need for the commission. But while we're waiting for that, I am gonna go and buy some more planter boxes and also check on how the, um, the current market price is for selling things because it was down quite low 
the last time I tried to sell anything or buy anything was at 75%, which is great for buying things and not so great for selling them. So Nora's still up here. She hasn't come down for our play date yet. Get eight more boxes. Thank you for your service to mankind, says Nora. Let's go ahead and give them both a lemon juice while we're here. Hi, Nora. Minister Lee did not look happy today. He prop. Let's give you a lemon juice. Wow, I've always wanted this. Thank you. I'm so happy. And one for you too. Technology will one day destroy our world again. That's what I learned from the history of corrupted world. If you find any corruption in the ruins, I implore you to tell us. You know, I don't think the problem is technology per se, Minister Lee. The problem is human nature and the fact that humans use technology for grievous purposes. Okay. Let's go check on the market price and see who else might be around to give gifts to and socialize with. Actually, let's go through the tree farm and give something to aid it if we can. Because it's not so much out of our way when we're up here. We've got a warning on our screen two hours until our play date. I hate it. I really like the life in Portia. Peaceful and relaxing. Oh, I'm out of amulets. Let's try a lemon juice. Oh, that's plus 10 too. Good. That's good to know. If I run out of amulets, I can always give Aidit a lemon juice and then I'm still getting a really good amount of friendship with him per gift. Let's head down to Peach Plaza. And if the market is up, we'll sell those planter boxes. Hi, Gust. I'm just going to bump into you and you're going to hide in a bush because you so don't want to talk to me. Spend your time on tasks you actually need to do. And I put all my apples in my drying rack so I can't give you an apple. Oh, well. Oh. I gave it to you anyway. Thank you, but next time you can choose a better one. Waste of a good aroma apple. I should have given it to your pig. Where is your pig? QQ was right here a minute ago. Where did QQ go? I do not see QQ. Oh, well. All right. One hour until our play date starts. Let's run over. There's QQ. Hey, QQ. 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 Have an aroma apple. Wink, wink, wink. Okay. And now we have just enough time to run over to the store. Pinky, I didn't go fishing. I'm sorry. I will go fishing. Maybe after the play date, I'll spend the evening fishing. To the store. Market price is 125%. Perfect. Let's sell all of these planter boxes. Confirm. Um, let's sell this pinecock bowler that I forgot to put away. And maybe we'll craft some things to sell a little bit later. All right, let's go play with Nora. Start playing. Do you have some place you want to go? Well, let me look at my map quick and see what our options are. We could go down to Amber Island and doodle in the sand. We could go play on the swings or the seesaw. We could go eat at the round table, and I do want to do that because, um, all right, let's take a little horseback ride around the square and stop in at the round table and have some food. Oh, I... I wonder if she would follow me up on the roof. That would be really funny. But that's not actually what I was trying to do. Dinner first, and then maybe we'll go doodle in the sand in Amber Island. Nora, you ready for food? 
If your aroma in here makes my mouth water, want to order something? Sure. What to do next? Um, I'm going to ask about work. What should I say? How's your missionary work going? Very smoothly. The people of Portia are so nice and supportive of what I do. I couldn't have wished for a better town to be at. What to do next? I'm going to ask about work again. What should I say? How's working for the church? It's very enlightening. I feel like we're doing a lot of good work beyond just letting people know that the relics from the past are dangerous. I've never felt so warm and happy. Well, she's fulfilled in what she does. That's good. Let's um, order. This meal's on me. What do you want to have? The food here is really great. I want to have some fire fruit mix, bamboo papaya with egg on top, supremely spicy spaghetti, grilled turkey, and lastly, I will have some Tolski goat milk. Yep, this is going to be great. Fire fruit mix, bamboo papaya with egg on top, supremely spicy spaghetti, grilled turkey, and Tolski goat milk. All right. Fire fruit mix. Supremely spicy spaghetti. Grilled turkey. Bamboo papaya with egg on top. Oh, she's not having any dessert. And Tolski goat milk. That was everything, right? I think so. Ooh, she's an expensive date compared to some uh, others. I Well, I guess I've only ever had one, but this is a lot more expensive. Whoa, all my favorites. You sure know how to please. What to do next? Um, we're going to leave and we're going to go ride over to Amber Island and do some doodles in the sand. Let's go, Nora. We'll take the Dee Dee because it's faster. Oh, there go all of the, the brothers on their way home. check my map again and see if there's anything else we can do for play. Doesn't look like it. Okay. All right. I want to doodle in the sand. Want to play here? I would like you to draw the moon. So here's the doodle tutorial. There's a timer. The imagined image is already on the sand. Trace it to doodle. When you trace the imagined image, a line will appear in the sand. And my horse is going to be in my way as I do this. Good to know. Ah! Horse, you are annoying. Ooh, I wonder if I could do it on horseback and have it go faster. Uh-oh, I'm running out of time. Hurry, hurry, hurry. Hurry, hurry, hurry. Looks pretty good. I finished that just in time. Oh my goodness. Um, and I got an extra point for that. I, I think we're going to go do something else now. Maybe sit under the wishing tree and talk because that was harder than I thought it would be. <laughs> Gather a bit of resin. You don't mind me gathering some resin while we're here, do you, Nora? So we will go to the Central Plaza Didi Stop, which is really up near the entrance to the collapsed wasteland. Oh, we could play. Let's play on the seesaw. I haven't done that yet. Want to play here? Okay, so the mood meter will be based on your performance. In the Seesaw minigame, your partner will tell you how high or low he or she wants to go. You can adjust the power gauge accordingly. Press and hold until the power gauge reaches the red area of the gauge. Ooh, interesting. Okay, I'm not sure 
I'm assuming this is the left mouse button, but I haven't done this before, so we'll see. Can you make me go lower? That's definitely lower, but I don't seem to be getting any additional friendship with her. Oh, space. You have to press and hold space. Hey, it's not doing much. Oh, she doesn't like she doesn't like my seesaw performance. Wah, too high. Oh, I'm so not good at this yet. Yay! Okay, she liked that one. See, I didn't realize it was spacebar. Hey, it's not doing much. Oh, I'm doing terrible at this. Let's not play that again. Okay, we'll do something else, Nora. Um let's go over here and sit under the wishing tree. I, I feel bad. I, I didn't make her happy. I'm a little tired. Can we sit down for a while? Sure. What to do next? Um, I'm going to compliment her. What should I say? Your temple uniform looks great. Or what's it like being a missionary? I already asked her what it's like being a missionary. That's not really a compliment. Um, so I'm going to tell her her temple uniform looks great. Really? Thank you. I like it as well. Okay, I got a few more points for that. And now I am out of action. So I need to leave. The play date needs to end. Play with Nora ends. I got plus 16 relationship. I had a great time. We should hang out some other day. I'm really sorry about the seesaw. I'll, I'll not do that with you again. And now I know how it works at least. Well, I do not have any tea tables for Mayor Gale, and I do not have any meat and mushroom stew for Dr. Zoo, but I'm at least going to say hello. If you don't feel very well, just come to the clinic. I'll offer you my best health. And you can have an herbal mixture. That's better than nothing. Thanks. This looks nice. My son Gust is nothing like me. Well, except for his talent and good-looking face. <laughs> I've already given you a gift today. Gail took care of me when no one else did. A life debt. So it's my honor to be his butler. And you can have a topaz, because I have plenty. I like this gift, thanks. Well, I don't think I'm going to be able to hand in this commission until tomorrow at this point. So I think I'm going to kill some more colorful llamas because I am running low on worn fur for fiber cloth. And I that came to my attention when I used up all of my fiber cloth. Also, I see Gust and Ginger down there and I haven't said hello to Ginger today. So I'll go say hello to Ginger. People in Portia are all very simple and friendly folks. I really enjoy having a conversation with everyone. And I will give her a lemon juice. I really love this. Thank you so much. But you really don't have to spend so much time preparing gifts. I'd rather you come see me more. I've already talked to Gust today. So let's go and slaughter colorful llamas as we make our way back toward the workshop. Because more worn fur. I have more colorful fur than I will ever need. But the worn fur for the fiber cloth is going to be helpful. And I'm quite low on it. Ooh, I have an idea. I haven't tried out these lion's claws yet. Let's try killing the colorful llamas with the lion's claws instead of the sword. Just just for a change, just for fun. And then just uh, turn around, show you these, these amazing boxing gloves. All right, where have all the llamas gone? I could have sworn there were more than that. They all running away from me. I think my sword has a little more reach than the boxing gloves do. But they're definitely one hitting the llamas. And then I'll go start the skyver again on some more worn fur and finish making these casual hoodies. Okay, I think I'm gonna switch the sword back to 
the correct place in my quick bar because that was novel but not particularly worth doing. What's the next upgrade going to cost? 90,000. Okay. So it is giving us some benefit, giving all those tea tables to the good mayor. And this is still fine. And I can make five fiber cloth. So let's do it. Let's go make that last casual hoodie. And see whether we have enough steel plates. Oh no, those are iron wood planks. We have one steel plate. Why are you working? Oh no, I let my furnace, my generator run down. Quick, quick, let's fix that. This is terrible. I thought I had checked them all in the morning and refueled, but I clearly did not do it, and all of my generators have stopped working. Get okay, power on, power on, and last one. 24 wood and power on. Okay, they're all good for two days, 11 hours, except for this one, which is only 22 hours. So let's fuel it up too. Okay, that's better but it's not better enough. I need to get more steel plates being made. Um, and I only have enough carbon steel for two. I was really hoping that I'd be able to make this furnace. I've got five steel plates at this point, which is only half of what I need. I'm going to stop the ironwood planks from being crafted because I don't need those currently and I'm gonna make steel plates instead. Now I won't quite be able to have them done tonight. Uh, actually, I should have put some of those on the other cutter which is only doing two. Can I? It just takes so long for it to smell. It's terrible. Yeah, there's really nothing else I can do except wait for them to be finished. So I'm just going to put away all of the wood and the charcoal. I'm up to 15 ironwood planks and I still have 44 hardwood planks here. So it's really just a question of getting more furnaces going, which I can't do until I have more carbon steel for the cutters. I can make nine more herbal tea. I really wish I could make my own lemon juice, but I have not found lemons anywhere. I imagine they'll probably add them to the game later, but for now, nothing I can do. All right, it's time for bed. That was a great social day, even though I didn't get my additional furnace made. So we're going to go to sleep now. Thanks so much for joining me and have a wonderful day, everyone.